getting ready to whoop this nigga's ass. Get that and that, my belt. Uh huh. Let's get it. <laughs> Woo! What is happening, Magnesites? We have some more Batman news. So it says that Matt Reeves confirms the Batman is starting over from scratch. Now I'm wondering what that means. So we are going to check out this article. And hey, Mr. Reeves, I'm going to see your last, last plan of the Apes movie tonight. And we'll do a review on it. So it says it has been months since Ben Affleck stunned the DCEU fans by stepping down as the director for the Batman. The film was left hanging for some time before Matt Reeves stepped in. The director is now starting to think about the Batman since his commitment on War for the Planet of the Apes is done. So that means he needs to think up a whole new story. Hmm. Recently, MTV snagged Reeves for a lengthy interview on its Happy, Sad, Confused podcast. The director talked at length about his approach to filming and his tenure with Planet of the Apes before turning to the Batman. While Reeves wouldn't say much, he did confirm his take on the Batman will move away from the script Affleck and Jeff Johns penned. No, Reeves explained, it's a story. It's just starting again. I'm excited about it. I think it's going to be really cool. It's a new story. It's a new story. Later, Reeves also asked if he... Later, Reeves also asked if he has approached anyone about casting for the project was also asked. I'm sitting here like, why am I? Anyway, MTV's Josh Horowitz specifically brought up Josh Gad's ongoing teases about him playing the Penguin, but the director had nothing like that. Has said, said nothing like that has happened. No, 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 no. The whole thing is just truly, I've been doing anything other than working on Planet F for the Apes. Hmm. He explained. There's another one? The whole thing is... Planet for the Apes? That another one is supposed to come out? Anyway, the interview also delved into how Reed became acquainted with Warner Brothers about the Batman project. The director said that the studio wanted uh, to meet with him about a general project, so Reeves took his time accepting given his Planet of the Apes gig. However, after Reeves learned the project's nature, he said he found some time to meet with the studio. When the director did meet with the studio, Reeves said he made a few things clear. Not only did I say this is the perspective where I want to come, which is a personal perspective, but I also said this, I'm not free. I cannot start on this right now, Reeves said. I'm working on a new movie. And I'm working on a movie I've been on for three years. And I'm certainly not going to drop the ball now. For now, it looks like Reeves is just starting to flush out his plan for the Batman as he takes a break following his legendary tenure with Planet of the Apes. There is no telling how the Batman may change moving forward, but fans have been quick to vocalize their most potent concern. Before Affleck excited, exited the movie. I don't know why I'm fucked up today. I don't know why this article has fucked me up. <laughs> we have got things on my mind. <laughs> Trust me, if you knew my private life right now, you probably would say, yeah, it's probably fucking you up. <laughs> uh, Joe Maniginiello was cast to play Deathstroke. If Reeves chooses to move away from the villain, 
then the actor may not get to suit up as the villain after all. And for fans, the loss would be hard. Damn. I wanted to see Deathstroke. Fuck. Uh, well, I thought Affleck made a great Batman. And uh, I would have assumed that they had penned a great script. Now I'm concerned. Not truly concerned, because Matt Reeves has a good track record with us as the fans, but, you know, knowing that Deathstroke was going to be in it, and, you know, what they were saying about the Batman seemed kind of cool, man. I, I, fuck. Well, we'll see. I mean, put it this way, Mr. Reeves, you have my trust. I've seen what you've done with the Apes movies, and I suspect that this one will be really good when I go to see it tonight, so... You know, post comments down below. Let me know what you all thought. If you enjoyed my video, hit the like button, subscribe, and share. If you did not, kiss thine black derriere. 10 million subscribers. Woo! You may now subscribe.